Yeah, this is Mike with Mike's Accessories with the 2020 Polaris Razor Pro XP Ultimate, uh, the Phantom Ghost Project UTV. Uh, today we're doing some stuff with the custom computer. Uh, right there is the custom Intel Hades Canyon Nook computer. Of course, I'll have cobwebbing down in here just to finish off the look and down through there and everything. You see I can change his eyeballs, the color of his eyeballs and stuff like that on it. Um, there'll be a video I do later, but you can change the outside, change the eyeballs and everything like that. Let me see if I can um, change. Well, I'm going to do a little bit more with this, but that'll be, I may do it here in a second. But I want to, we're playing a movie. Uh, through all the, the screens, got six total screens. Uh, seven count the ride command, but they don't show on the ride command. So we got a lot of people to thank. We've got Razor um, for uh, partnering with us on the keyboard, wireless keyboard, wireless mouse, control everything. Of course, we got a touch screen right there that controls everything too, um, everything without the keyboard. So, and um, get the keyboard to light back up again. There we go. And uh, we got Razor also, Razor gaming, video gaming controllers, uh, which you've seen. Um, we hydrographed it, hydrographed it, hydrographed it, um, and I put one together. We, we're doing the next hydrographics on the next one. And then there's the uh, custom uh, DVD burner reader. It's in the console. It's got like a little lid that pops up and down to close it up. That's going to be the really the special attraction of the project, that. Um, and also at the computer, we got uh, OWC to thank Other World Computing. Uh, for all the internal stuff in it, the hard drive, I mean the, the memory, the, um, the, 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 the hard drives. Yeah, it's got, it's got two terabyte of hard drive, plus we got an extra three, an extra terabyte that'll be mounted in here for an extra terabyte that'll be, so the computer will have a three total terabyte, three terabytes. Um, so, and uh, we got a lot of video games on it right now. We're, we're starting to do some video games things. We got Logitech. Um, steering will be going there. You've seen it in other videos I've done, and the pedals down there, and the gear shifter down there. I made a custom fiberglass piece for the gear shifter, and uh, so we got Logitech thing. We got a lot of video game things we're gonna be doing too, and everything. So just stay tuned, and everything. And uh, this is just a mock up of how everything's gonna look with the computer, and it sounds really good. Let me go ahead and. Subwoofers are fixing to go off. Let's see, we got them going back to the sub. It's fixing to hit. Right here in a second. Here we come. Feel them subs moving. Feel them moving. Feel the air popping out of the ports. But you'll see this. Um, guarantee this will be the top project in the U.S. Uh, man, got a lot of companies to thank. Um, and but I just want to do a mock up, We're running everything off the uh, Ames Power Turbo, like Ames Power. Go ahead and turn this down a little bit, but it sounds really good. There we go, turn it down a little bit. There we go. And like I said, got Ames Power to thank on the power inverter. Of course, we got Dish Network in the satellite television. You can see some of the airbrushing right there. Uh, this is just a mock-up of the computer, but this is how it's going to pretty much look and everything. Of course, the dash should be on here and the little panel that I had cut with a clear piece of plexiglass so you can see down and see the computer. Now let me see if I can change uh, the eyeballs um, on that. Uh, let's see. Um, let's see. I'm trying to get out of... There's the DVD pull pushed out of the DVD burner reader. Uh, let's see. I gotta try to figure out how to get out of here a little easier, but that'll just be something I'll have to figure out and everything like that. So uh, let's do this right here. There we go. Still a little bit of things I gotta try to figure out, but it's nothing major. Well, now we're out of that. Now I can be able to change the eyeballs and stuff. Let's see. There we go. There's the skull. You can see him right there.
get it to load up right here in a second. There we go. Now he's red. Now he's yellow. Now he's green. Now he's blue green. Now he's red. Look at this. Now he's breathing. Let's see, I had to get the screen over a little bit more. There we go. Now let's do the eyes. The eyes are yellow right now. Let's do them red. There's some red eyes. We got some yellow and green. Greenish blue. Like it says, nothing in the U.S. world to touch the Phantom Ghost Project UTV. Got a lot of companies to thank. Uh, a lot of the companies make the project possible with that stuff, but I do all the fiberglass, and you see the headliner, door panels, console I built for amp amplifier sitting behind that um, masking paper right there. But that's just a mock-up of the computer and everything like that, and I'm trying to think of anybody else on the computer side we got to thank. Um... No, that's pretty much it, I think, and everything. So we got some games coming along we're fixing to be doing and get this project done.